Greetings and salutations, I'm Kev, welcome back to this let's play of Europa Universalis 4 as the Great Horde, and I think it's time to unfriend Nogai. They immediately broke the alliance, no surprise there. They're gonna break the uh, axis soon too. Gassimuk took the tributary state thing, that's fine. Good, you set Poland as a rival, that's excellent, so now... That rivalry should continue. And hopefully they're gonna, they're gonna be more likely to join in a war against them. Right, we need to stop embargoing Kazan. As soon as we can do that, we'll do, we are gonna do that. 30th of December, that's fine. Uh, I want to... So here's the thing, these tributaries, which schools do they follow? Oh well, he, he's so orthodox, so that doesn't matter. Gazdremuk on the other end would give us something. As would Shervan, if they ever get over their hate for us, which I don't think they ever will. Uh, what about you down there? Uh, you're in the, in the same school as we are. Right, admin tech cost. Yeah, okay. You're not, though. So if I keep buttering up... Gazrimuk. There's a chance. No, we have a core of theirs. Um... No, no, they'll, ne they'll never get. Uh, they'll never get happy enough. <sighs> okay, let's not do that then. Sherman still has a ton of liberty desire. As much as I would like the ducats, I think we're still very much stuck on getting manpower. We haven't extorted our subjects yet, but we just might have to at some point. Mm, there's a revoke embargo. Let's just get the diplomat back, please. And let's get this done before the end of the year. Excellent. Yeah, they're never gonna get happy enough, so bring you back. I need to get you into something more reasonable. Why do we still have. Right. Cancel the lack. You're gonna suffer attrition if I stand here, so half of you is gonna go over to Perm, I think. Wait for the inevitable rebellions. Uh, Bashkirian Perm, Dagestan, and Shervan is the other one. So you're gonna go down that way. Right, we took the mission to convert Dagestan. That's never gonna happen. Just play never gonna happen. We're never gonna get the missionary strength to do that. At least not for a good time yet, a good long time yet. So uh, we're gonna cancel that mission. Getting closer on this one. The guy. Kipchuk, Kazan we already have, Kazimov we need to take from Moscow. So the other three are basically Nogai, this one, and uh, Kipchuk over there, and this one. 
But now we board the Reuse back. We're big and strong now. Allied to Afghanistan. Novgorod is allied to Perm and Chagatai. I rivaled. Wait a second. I rivaled you, but you would still take an alliance? What? I don't think that's true. We'll see how that goes. Um, we can actually take a diplomat. Wow. We can take a technology. Woo! Woo! Fancy! Fancy schmancy. Uh, we might as well, I suppose. We're not going to spend the diplomatic point doing anything significant. And it's going to take a long time before we get the renaissance. At the present time. We could accept a culture. Oh, computer mouse, come on. Discover that it is an X, X and Y axis. Just one. Yeah, it's very fond of the X axis, not so much of the Y axis right now. Come on. You can do this. Someday I'll have enough money to buy a new one. Ah, uh, let's see. Okay, um. At this rate, we might have. I wonder, if I do that, that's going to lower the revolt risk down there, isn't it? No, why the hell not? Let's do it. That should lower the revolt risk in the Dagestani area. Quite a lot, actually. Quite a lot. It's mostly gone. It's just the southern province of Shervan left. Okay, and that's fine then. Then our troops can sit there and uh, deal with this. Great, 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 great news. Uh, can we still buy a tech? No, of course not. Yeah, that's fine. Um, <sighs> that diplomat can go in around out out outrage countries. Have fun. The other one, I think, is going to start spying on the guy. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised. I would have thought they would have broken the royal marriage. I really would have thought. You know you're trying to influence Perm, are you? You hate our gods, they're hostile. Now you'd take the alliance. I was wondering. Um, yeah, if I fight you, I'm gonna have to fight all that stuff anyway. Now the provinces I want from Muscovy are all in the interior, so there's no real point in making claims all the way around, all the way around there. Um. And I assume Poland is still in debt. Yeah, they're not making a dent in their debt. Theodoro. Did you ally Theodoro? You allied Theodoro. God. So if I hadn't dragged in the Ottomans earlier, I could have gotten them into a war with the with Russia this way. Ah, uh, okay. Um, 1474 for that truce. And we won't have anyone near enough favors for that time anyway. That's gonna be. Seven favors at 14 years. Actually, that's going to be fairly close. But the situation is going to ch uh, will have changed by then. And the tribes are unhappy because they don't have enough land. Of course. Um. I 
don't really want to do that down there, though. That's just gonna double up on our problems. If I make a Dagestani province. Um... Well, Manzur is okay. If I can even do that with Manzur. Oh, there we go. Is that not enough? Still not enough. Uh, well, Penza is pretty crap, but I'm still coring it. Well, fine then. Here you go. Still not enough? Ah, for Pete's sake. Um. And this isn't a state core. Well, we're going to make that a state. And pay for the costs. I'll turn this over to the tribes. Finally. Yeah, the tribes are going to be difficult to manage <laughs> in the long run. They're quite loyal right now. Uh, can I in any way extort them from that? No, I cannot. Okay. And we lost a leader. Pity. That was the siege dude. Um, I cannot afford to train because there might be a rebellion right under their foot. Under their feet. Let's improve relations. Dryazan. I could turn them into a march. A march. March. Whatever. Yeah, that thing. Would help. Oh, you ate them up, did you? Good for you. Crimea no more. All of them are still giving us manpower. Which is fine. We're gonna lose a bit of horde unity now. That's fine too. We kind of need to stabilize. Still bleeding money. You sold the province to Sherman. Really? Huh. I don't really see the AI sell provinces. What kind of a need? Is that because of their traits? Hmm. Yeah, sell the provinces when in debt. Okay. So they might do a little fire sale thing going on there. Uh, have a fire sale go on. We shall see. Um. Then goes Trebsond. You are fighting Venice. They were guaranteed. Ah, I see. Okay, so you are fighting the whole trade league and everyone then. Or not. You're not fighting the trade league. Unless Venice... Venice has a trade league. So they couldn't call in their trade league on a guarantee. Okay, interesting. Ragusa is sort of blocking the way. Are you still guaranteeing Ragusa? You are. So he can't really push in there. And if he goes after Hungary, that's going to be his funeral. Um. Okay, they broke the royal marriage with us. That's fine. And we have a truce until... Sometime. <laughs> 66. Yeah, that's fine. I can't really attack Nogai anyway. By then we might have the favors from the Uzbeks. And they do desire land. 
So if they have stabilized their situation, we might be able to swing something there. Uh, Moscow, on the other hand, it's a bit problematic. What the heck's going on here? Novograd separatists, lovely. And I still don't have contact with Denmark, sadly. Uh, but at least they did. Oh, there we go. Wait, what? Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, okay. That's interesting. Perhaps godlike ruler. Or is this the one? Yeah, it's this one. Yeah. That's fine. Doing okay. You have a crappy ruler, but you're still. Wait, I thought you were at Miltech 4 a moment ago. Or Miltech 5, I mean. Okay, then. You're not. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Not that I can do anything right now. I still need the favors from. Ooh. I like. I like that bit, at least. Not so much else. I would love to hire uh, advisors, but we're so poor. We're so poor! Right, um, my troops are still waiting for rebellion. I don't dare train them. Completely forgot that we sent someone to the Mamluks. <laughs> Let's get them back. Uh, there are other, other fish to fry. And one of them go around with the, our allies. And subjects and... yeah. Actually no, that would be in relations with the Uzbeks, which is not really that useful. Come to think of it, would they come into a war with Nogai? Hell no. And they would not even come on a promise of land. Okay. Theodora would not come to their aid, you don't say. Poland, pay your debts. Crikey, it's gonna be go everything's gonna fall to apart because Poland doesn't pay their debts. Ah, uh, um. We could fight Moscow alone. I'd rather not, but I, we could. In which case, we want to fight right now. Or do we? They are going to do some fancy footwork, aren't they? They're not integrating other subjects. They are backing up Sweden. So if Sweden suddenly decides to jump on the offensive, they're going to be in that mess. And they no longer have a truce with Novgorod. They might well attack Novgorod. Who has no friends? How long until that class favor? Oh, well, we'll wait. We, I kind of need my rebellions to fire too, so. And I have a tech. Let's get this tech. Yeah, a little bit of corruption. Cannot afford to pay it down. Uh, Azov, what's gonna happen? Timbrids. Yeah, okay. 
forgot to check if we can actually get them up to that point, but yeah, we can. Off we go. Improve relations, fire and forget. Do you, do you rival no, Yeah, you rival no guy. That's why. Yeah, the Uzbeks are gonna have fun with their rebels for quite some time, by the looks of things. You're repositioning your troops. You're preparing for something. I know you are. Just a question of what. And we know that if he attacks Ryazan, or Rostov, we're gonna be in this war. Ryazan still hasn't bothered with uh, troops. I almost wish that rebellion could fire. Wait, 14 years! Yikes, okay, that's not gonna happen anytime soon then. Our whole unit is plummeting. Did we get that last favor with Poland? Oh, never mind. Uh, still two years away. There was Penzan going over. Okay, so we killed the revolters from the other provinces, that's fine. The question now is, do I want to strike at... Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's right. The separatists will go into... No into... Uh, into here as well. And they have. That's Pushkov Novel Rebels. Poor Pushkov. Um, and we can finally talk to Denmark. We can finally talk to Denmark. I'm not going to put that on as friendly because they are rivals to Poland. I don't want to make Bohemia hostile, I could. But if I make them hostile, Poland might think I want to join a war over there. Uh, good god, Ming, what the hell are you doing? Out of manpower again. Because you're going to have to fight tons of rebels. Yeah, but you're going to beat them down. As you always do. And the mouse cursor decides to act up again. Arg! Come on, stupid mouse cursor. There we go. Nothing a good thunk won't, won't, won't cure. I right, thank you. There we go. And, um... <laughs> I could feed all of this to Ryazan. But they would become a, such a large and unruly subject. I'm not sure I want to risk that. And these are good provinces, the ones we need. It all depends on what we can manage. But we still need to beat them. And I sp spent so much time getting Poland in on this, but they're not going to be able to go there because... Because of their effing debts. And also because I was stupid enough to annex a country, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, this is going to last until 1469. Which is good. This, on the other hand, is going to last us to 1469. Oh, okay, so it's way... Okay, that's fine, because that was the reward for annexing them. It, so it softens the blow. But not particularly much. And if I wait until 1469, we're going to have no whole unity left. At least it's gonna feel like that. The other thing, if, if I go to war now, they're gonna be at Miltec 4. We're gonna be at Miltec 6. Hmm. 
I wonder. I wonder. I'll have to think about this for a second. I'll have to think. And we'll see what we do. Thank you for watching.